What's up, YouTube? Appreciate you for tuning in. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Now, before we get into the video, as always, I want to say I appreciate everybody with that like button. It really helps my videos get recommended. Now, today's video, we got NBA Lil Pav. So, we all know that he was accused for the situation of, you know, G Money. So, I guess they ended up pinging his phone or whatever. He was in the area. So, you know, he had to end up having to plead guilty for the situation. But it wasn't, you know, for the actual doing. It was for accessory. So, you know, he was in the car with the person. He assisted. So, you know, that's what he ended up getting. They were saying that he was in the courtroom. And he was basically trying to explain that he was innocent. But they was, you know go give him life if he end up you know losing his case against the whole situation so he ended up pleading guilty for the five years and then he also got a situation where you know he got a gun case too it just seemed like it's a lot that's not in his favor but it's better than you know facing life and that was the best choice he could have made and it's horrible you know because you may be innocent in the situation but you know you're not trying to fight the court and then end up getting life but a lot of people end up saying that he innocent including like his ops like Fredo Bang end up saying he was innocent before but you know a lot of people say that because because, you know, first, they don't want to snitch. And then second, they will like them, see them out. They don't want to see them do no time because they want to, you know, handle the situation themselves. But I honestly think, you know, he was innocent in the situation because, you know, even his mama or, you know, G Money Mama ended up responding to the situation. And she was saying, you know, he innocent. And that right there made me feel like the whole city know who actually did it. But, you know, they not really going to say nothing. And they want the streets to really handle it. But the courtroom didn't catch who um, ended up doing it. Now, they also end up bringing up Lil Yoshi and situation because they were saying there was a lot of shootings going back and forth so they didn't really know you know who did it you know what was going on it was a lot of people involved basically and they also end up saying that you know let yoshi end up shooting you know a little pap in the situation so it was just saying there's a lot of shootings going on but to me i feel like this whole situation crazy but i feel like he got the good end of it you know only getting like five years and then he got time served also so you know it's not gonna be as bad as you know getting like 10 years 15 years but y'all let me know in the comment section how you feel about this whole situation Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you in the next video.